Cold War. The Cold War denotes a geopolitical standoff between nations characterized by the absence of direct military engagement, instead employing strategies such as economic and political maneuvers, propaganda, espionage, and proxy wars. It is frequently associated with the American-Soviet Cold War spanning 1947 to 1989. Colonial War the Colonial Wars is an armed conflict between colonial powers and indigenous populations or rival colonial entities, motivated by economic interests and territorial expansion. Invasion The invasion constitutes a large-scale military offensive where combatants from one geopolitical entity forcefully enter territory controlled by another with the primary aim of either conquering, liberating, re-establishing control, or authority over the territory. Conventional Warfare the conventional warfare is characterized by organized state armies engaging in open confrontation, employing traditional weapons and battlefield tactics. Clearly defined forces on each side primarily target the opponent's military, adhering to recognized rules of engagement. Unconventional warfare. The unconventional warfare involves non-traditional military strategies, often employed by irregular forces against a conventional or occupying power. It includes guerrilla tactics, insurgency, and asymmetrical approaches aiming to exploit the weaknesses of a stronger adversary. Total War The Total War is a type of warfare that includes any and all civilian-associated resources and infrastructure as legitimate military targets, mobilizes all of the resources of society to fight the war, and gives priority to warfare over non-combatant needs. Limited War The Limited Wars have specific goals, avoiding widespread destruction and escalation. Unlike Total War, they often involve restrictions on certain weapons or tactics. Nuclear War The nuclear war involves the use of nuclear weapons in armed conflict. These immensely powerful weapons release energy through nuclear reactions, causing devastating explosions and long-term radiation effects. Undeclared War The undeclared war is a military conflict between two or more nations without either side issuing a formal declaration of war. World War the World War is a large-scale conflict spanning multiple nations or regions involving complex global alliances with significant impact on continents. Examples include World War I and World War II, marked by extensive participation, geopolitical shifts, and global consequences. Chemical War The chemical warfare employs toxic chemicals like gases or liquids to cause harm to humans, animals, or the environment during conflict. This method aims to incapacitate or eliminate the enemy by exposing them to hazardous chemical substances. Biological War The biological war involves the use of biological agents such as bacteria or viruses with the intent to harm or kill people, animals, or plants. This can be achieved through the deliberate release of pathogens, toxins, or other biological substances to cause illness or death. Electronic War the Electronic War focuses on the use of electromagnetic signals to gain a tactical advantage. It includes activities like jamming enemy communications, intercepting signals, and disrupting radar systems. Information War The Information War utilizes technology for strategic advantage, manipulating, spreading disinformation, or disrupting communication to influence opinions and undermine adversaries. Forms include cyber attacks, propaganda, and psychological operations. Guerrilla War The guerrilla war characterized by small, mobile, and flexible groups using tactics such as ambushes, hit-and-run attacks, and sabotage. Typically employed by weaker forces against a conventional or occupying power, guerrilla warfare aims to disrupt the enemy's operations and erode their strength over time. A war of Liberation The War of Liberation is a conflict where a group or nation fights to free itself from oppression, occupation, or foreign control, aiming to achieve independence and self-determination. These wars are often characterized by a quest for freedom and the establishment of sovereign governance. Space War The space war involves the use of military force in outer space. It includes activities such as satellite attacks, anti-satellite weapons, and potential conflicts over strategic positions. Psychological War the psychological war involves the use of psychological tactics to influence the thoughts, emotions, and behaviors of individuals or groups. It aims to achieve strategic objectives by manipulating perceptions, spreading disinformation, inducing fear, or creating confusion. Proxy War The proxy war is a conflict where two or more external powers support rival factions or groups within a country, using them as proxies to advance their own interests without engaging in direct military confrontation. This indirect approach allows external actors to influence or manipulate the course of a conflict, often exacerbating tensions within the targeted nation. Faultline War 
The fault line war refers to a conflict arising from deep-seated, ethnic, religious, or cultural divisions within a nation. These fault lines become sources of tension and can lead to violent conflicts as different groups seek to assert their identity or control. Civil War The Civil War is an armed conflict within a single country involving factions due to political, ideological, or socioeconomic divisions, causing internal hostilities and lasting impacts on society, economy, and politics. Range War The Range War, common in 19th and early 20th century American West, is a violent conflict over control of open range for cattle grazing. Marked by clashes over water, grazing rights, and cattle ownership, these disputes earn the name Range Wars. Economic War The economic war is a strategy where nations use economic measures as tools of conflict. This includes imposing sanctions, trade restrictions, or manipulating financial systems to achieve political or military objectives. The goal is to exert pressure on an adversary by targeting its economic stability and resources, influencing its behavior without direct military engagement. Religious War The religious war is a conflict primarily motivated by religious differences or ideologies. These wars typically involve hostilities between groups adhering to different faiths or sects, seeking to assert their religious beliefs, and, in some cases, to convert others. The Political War the political war employs diplomatic, informational, military, and economic means to influence other states or groups strategically. It seeks to shape perceptions, gain support, and exert influence globally or domestically without relying solely on military force. Attrition War The attrition war is a strategy where the objective is to gradually wear down the enemy's strength and resources through continuous losses, reducing their ability to fight effectively. This approach typically involves prolonged engagements and seeks to outlast the opponent rather than achieving decisive victories. Asymmetric War The asymmetric war is a form of conflict wherein the involved parties exhibit substantial disparities in military power, strategy, or tactics, frequently characterized by engagements between irregular forces such as insurgents or militias, and established standing armies, it may involve tactics challenging traditional rules of warfare. Expeditionary War The Expeditionary War involves military operations conducted abroad by a nation's forces, often beyond its borders. It includes deployments for various purposes such as combat or peacekeeping. Hybrid War The Hybrid War combines conventional and unconventional tactics, blending military, political, economic, and informational strategies to achieve objectives. It's a versatile approach that goes beyond traditional war, often involving non-state actors and unconventional methods. Cyber War The cyber war involves using digital tactics to disrupt or damage an adversary's computer systems, networks, or information. It's a form of warfare focused on the virtual realm, encompassing cyber attacks, hacking, and electronic manipulation for strategic advantage. Entomological War The entomological war involves using insects as weapons for military purposes. This can include deploying insects to spread diseases, disrupt agriculture, or cause other forms of harm. It's a biological warfare strategy that exploits the capabilities of insects to impact the enemy's resources and infrastructure.